This is a basic modified Darcy choke without the arm. So it's a Darcy without the arm. Call it what you want. You're going to come in this way, and as you step in, get that room here. I'm going to push his head down, and I'm going to sink my arm, pushing him this way so I can get into the choke, making sure that this chin is not covering the choke to protect him, right? And as I twist, I'm going to grab my bicep and put it up on the top, and then I'm going to start to apply the pressure until he taps. Okay? We'll flip the other side. Again, I step in, pull his head down. This is sort of a simultaneous movement, right? So I'm, I'm here, right? I move up underneath, watching the chin, making sure the chin doesn't get in here to protect him because the chin's tucked. Tuck your chin. I can't get up underneath it, right? <clears throat> so what I'm doing is I'm pushing the head and I'm twisting at the same time. By twisting, this opens up the neck and he's less likely to be able to protect his chin. And I also get a bit of a neck crank in this process, mm -hmm. okay? So I can grab this way, which is sort of like a guillotine, or I can do the modified, modified Darcy without the arm, right, or without this arm, I'm sorry. And as this comes up, I grab the back of my bicep, and I, I'm not even sinking it all the way, and I can already start to feel it going, okay? So as I get here, reach to the back of his neck, I'm gonna squeeze, okay? Sorry, buddy, you all right? Oof, yeah. Okay, so that's a basic <laughs> modified Darcy without the arm, with a little bit of a neck crank in there for flavor.